not the result you want, but was it the right club? Here we are on the 18th green. We all know about this roll off here. Uh, if we've just missed the green on the left, it does leave quite a tricky shot onto the top level. Here I am with the lob wedge, trying to get fancy with it, and I don't think it's the right club. The ground's really soft, it's on a piece of mud, and now I've got the same problem again. But there is a solution, and that solution is this. Take a straighter face club, don't be afraid to use the putter, just to roll it up this nice surface, up towards the pin. Let's see if that works. Much safer. That's got me onto the green. It's a really consistent shot. With a bit of practice, I can get that closer. There is one more option that I can do, and it's with this little club here. We've all got these hybrid clubs, even a fairway one if you like, a little bit of loft on the face. And uh, it's a very, very good club. When you're down in a swale like this, you'll see this shot a lot at British Opens and things like that, where the ball rolls off. Todd Hamilton made this uh, shot very popular a few years ago at the Open. We actually claim the claret jug. All you've got to do is play the ball a little bit back in your stance, shorten the grip, a little bit of weight on the left side, and then just put it. Just play it like a putter, but just roll that ball up the slope, onto the green, and again, it's a really secure shot to get that ball on the green, and I've saved myself a shot from this horrendous doff in the first place. So have a little go with that. We've got lots of areas around the golf course with these runoffs. Hybrid, putter, even something like a seven iron or a six iron just to chip the ball onto the green. It's a much safer shot, especially at this time of year. Finally, I'd just like to say, uh, I'd like to wish you all a very happy Christmas. Thank you for watching these videos. More importantly, thank you for supporting us this year. We've had 10 weeks without any business, uh, but you've supported us superbly in the times that we have been open and uh, we look forward to carrying that on in the new year. Happy Christmas and a happy new year. Bye.